that reminds me of another song. It's, uh, it's got a line that says, um, whatever adjective we may use, but for now, let's call it art. So we'll call it art. And a person who does it, they call him an artist. So in that way, I'm an artist. about pushing the limitations it's about understanding the material and as you work with something the understanding grows it's like a it's like a language if I can put it that way so so first you understand just the vocabulary now you understand how to put those words into a sentence and write poetry it's quite hard to actually define where inspiration comes from for me it's driving in the streets it's interacting with people it's the environment in which you live it's the news it's looking at other pieces of art it's being in museums and galleries it's reading it's, it's like you take little bits and pieces from every part of um, of the interactions that you have in the world and it all just bundles together in some kind of way into something that becomes art it's a storytelling which is important uh, to tell our stories in a different way. That's what always fascinates me. If you go to like a drawing class and you'll see how everybody's just got their own handwriting. They just can't make it the same. I love people. I'm fascinated by how we all walk on the same earth. We all have more or less the same things influencing us and yet we're all different. Art, art, art it's a tool to drive and, 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 and bring some conversations so that people can start thinking. You know, people, we're watching too much TV these days and uh, watch too much Generations, we watch too much soapies and stuff, and life is not soapy. All I'm trying to do is to inspire change positively, you understand, to eradicate everything that seems to decay our beautiful community and society. <laughs>